Hey everyone, today I'll be teaching you how to make these delicious beignets. So let's get started with the video. In a stand mixer bowl or regular bowl, add one cup of warm water, two teaspoons of dry active yeast, and one tablespoon of sugar. Then whisk everything together until well combined. When you're finished, let your mixture sit for 7 to 10 minutes. Meanwhile, in a bowl, add one egg and one egg yolk. Then beat your eggs until smooth. Set your eggs to the side and in another bowl, add four and one thirds cup of bread flour or all purpose flour. and one teaspoon of salt. Whisk everything together until well combined. Now set the bowl to the side and get the bowl with the yeast mixture. A sort of foam should have formed on the top of your mixture. In that bowl add one thirds cup of sugar, two thirds cup of buttermilk, your beaten eggs from before, and three tablespoons of melted unsalted butter. Now whisk everything until well combined. Then attach the bowl to the stand mixer. Add your flour mixture from before into the bowl. Using the hook attachment, mix the wet and dry ingredients together on medium speed until a smooth dough is formed. This should take about two to three minutes. Once your dough has pulled away from the inside of the bowl, your dough should be ready. Next, lightly grease a large bowl with olive oil. Then add your dough into the bowl and cover the bowl with plastic wrap. Once you've covered the bowl in plastic wrap, let it sit at room temperature or in a warm area for 1 hour and 30 minutes. After that time, your dough should have doubled in size. Lightly flour a clean surface and then roll your dough out. Add flour to the top of your dough and to your rolling pin and roll out your dough until it is a half an inch thick. Once you've rolled out your dough, cut your dough into one and a half to two inch squares.
When you're finished, separate your beignets so they don't stick together and after that you can begin frying them. In a deep fryer or a large pot, heat oil up to 350 degrees and cook your beignets for about 1-2 to two minutes per side or until golden brown. Halfway into cooking your beignets, one side should be golden brown. This is when you're supposed to flip them. Once your beignets have finished cooking and both sides are golden brown, take your beignets out of the fryer and place them on a wire rack. Repeat this process until you've fried all of your beignets. Once you've finished frying your beignets, you can now plate everything up. Place your beignets on a plate and add honey and powdered sugar. And this is the finished result. The beignets tasted amazing. Adding honey on it is optional, but it tastes so good. One of the reasons I added honey was because that's what Tiana did in Princess and the Frog, and I wanted to do the same. The beignets were sweet and fluffy and really, really good. They were also pretty easy to make. I totally recommend. I really wanted to make beignets from scratch, so I'm really happy these came out so well. Oh, and for this recipe, you don't need a stand mixer, it just makes it easier. You can just use a regular bowl. I'll have a link to the recipe I used for this video in the description below. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Everything I used in this video will be down in the description below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!